fantastic. What's up guys, my name is Section from the Deviants, and today we're going to be reacting to Fruits Basket Season 1, Episode 23. So in the last episode, we got Hanajima's backstory, in which basically they spelled out that Hanajima has had this power since she was very little, in which she can feel people's waves. She can't, I, I'm guessing she can't interpret people's thoughts, but she can interpret how people feel about a situation. Not only that is, uh, she can give people headaches and a bad enough headache to knock them out. So she was labeled as a witch and she isolated herself until, you know, Toru came in and now we're all good. So this episode's labeled, you look well. I'm guessing the three dots right afterwards uh, is sarcastic. So it's, you look well, or maybe there should be a question mark. I don't know. I'm guessing we're done with Hanajima's story since it felt like it was a good wrap up in the last episode. Without further ado, let's get straight on into it. Make sure to put the original content as always. All right, let's get going in three, two, one, and go. Your final exam scores should be posted. Those of you with failing scores in any subject will be taking makeup exams on Sunday. Yo. I'm sure you passed everything, Toru, right? <laughs> Someone tells me no. Well, let's hear it. Did you fail? Uh oh. Take heart. And if it helps, you scored wonderfully compared to me. I failed them all. What? Miss Honda? How'd it go? Do you have makeups? <laughs> it's okay. Yuki took time away from his own studies to tutor me, and I still failed. What a terrible way to repay his kindness. You shouldn't let it get to you too much. You'll be okay. Everybody... What, what's Kyo thinking in the back? It's true. You got a makeup. <laughs> <laughs> she does the same, same thing. I'm feeling a little dizzy. Oh, Kyo, you better catch her. No, fake. Hey, I, hey, I guess that works. With you? You keep worrying about it, you'll make yourself sick and wind up with a fever or... Uh... Yep, a bit of a fever. My diagnosis? I wish I could calculate in my head. Go on, get to bed already. What about dinner? I haven't gone to buy any of the ingredients yet. And they're expecting Give him a list. work, too. Relax, Toru. Call off. No chores or work today. <sighs> First I fail one of my finals and then I come down with a stupid fever. Mommy G, oh. volume down, please. I wanted to let you know that she wouldn't be there today. Oh, that makes sense. Momo G, you better come with some soup or something. I'm so confused. What's going on here, Kyo? Kyo like, is genius? helping out. Are you doing all this for Toru? Heck yeah. It'd be pretty crappy to ask someone who's sick to cook. It's gonna turn out horrible. <laughs> ah, to be young and innocent again. What happened to your innocence? Yes. Of course. Did you prepare this for me yourself, Q? Well, it's nothing special. Just eat it, will ya? I don't know how they sit like that. My feet would hurt so badly. It's delicious. <laughs> I'm sorry you had to do this for me. If you're so sorry, then don't get sick in the first place. <laughs> That's not what you should be saying. What's wrong? Tell me. You need to talk. I'll listen. See, that that's some good words to say, Kyo. Stick to that. I failed a test and feel like a disgrace. <laughs> and I feel bad for wasting Yuki's time. I just wish I could be more reliable. Put a hand on the head. Put a hand on the head. Listen, you can just make up the bad grade by retaking the test. And who gives a damn about Yuki anyway? Work him to death. <laughs> Literally. Just hurry up and get better so that goofy smile of yours comes back. <laughs> My smile's goofy. Heck yeah. So I don't mind cooking a meal or two if it'll bring your smile back. Okay? I didn't see it at first. But this is his way of cheering me up. I'm happy. Are you sure, Hari? You can't give Toro a shot if it'll hurt her. I can barely feel it. 
Just yeah. Howdy kept poking him over and over again. True, but that was on purpose. You sadistic fiend! How could you be so cruel? <laughs> Get out of here, both of you. You're disturbing my patient. <laughs> so sad. Rest up and keep warm. I will. How should I pay you? Apparently, there are many around here who won't sleep well until you're back to your old self again. Call me if you need anything. That means nothing. If you didn't catch it. Wait, he's not that old. Oh, but uh, I guess when you're as young he's, as Kisa. He's 27? Oh, gosh, I gotta get my life together. What'd he say? That it isn't too serious and that I should. How's he do his hair? I put together some sample problems for the makeup test. So the makeup test went well? I'm happy you don't have to worry anymore. And Hanachan passed this time around as well. Huh. Hold up. Did you fail on purpose? I mean, that's pretty smart. It would be so nice if the summer sun decided to come out. That'd dry us off. Good luck. I wish so... more rain happened. What about you, Yuki? Do you like the season? Hmm. Well, it's not my favorite. But I bet you like it, Looking huh, for cars. You coming? Oh, is he sick now? This isn't your fault. It's just he gets kind of sluggish every time it rains. That's what Haru told me. How about we get out of the street? I'm sorry. Okay. I don't have to apologize, you know. Yeah, apparently it's just the way my body Who are you? Are you the horse? Nay, 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 nay. Of course it stops raining when we get home. Who's, uh, the weather. gosh, who was Kyo's teacher? The one who trained him how to fight. Kyo! Uh, oh, gosh. <laughs> Do you think she's okay? I she's gonna bust open that door. Are you sure? <sighs> Never mind. Are you sure about that? <laughs> well, spit it out. Can I come by because I want to see you? No, because no. I don't want to see you. <laughs> I'll kill you. He he just didn't want the table to get broken. He just doesn't want the house to get wrecked. No way, yeah. I refuse. What would we even do? Toru dear, why don't you give them your shopping list for dinner? Ooh. Let's go! No. You could have opened the door. The house is safe for now. She should really tone it down a little or a lot. Actually, I wonder if she's already trying to. I wonder what the reason could be. What a mess. I feel like I know who. If you're both free, maybe you should go on a little date as well. Uh, oh no, that's okay. I should... I'd like that. Heck yeah. If you're okay with the usual secret base. Uh, plant some chives? Is it chives weather? Let's see. Eggs, milk, fermented soybeans. Oh, she put fish on here too, Kyo, your favorite. She doesn't know about you yet, does she? What do you mean? So then, do you plan on hiding it forever? You shut up! Kyo. I can't believe you go and go in public, you're the worst! I feel like she's the only one that could kind of like rein him in. Why are you so obsessed with me? Oh. Any sane person would try to avoid me, or at least keep me at arm's length. What's that to do with the bracelet? That day, when it happened, what I felt. Know what? If I told you, you'd cry, so... Now can't you? Secrets? Uh, oops, I'm sorry, I... Is something wrong? Ooh, nay, 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 nay. You know how I hate it whenever people get clingy. Of course I do, but that's no fun. Kyo, uh, you look well. Kyo. You, you said Kyo already. Master? Master. Oh, he, he trained him in Hatsuharu, right? I don't know. I, I, I feel like Kagura should end up with Kyo just because I feel like Kagura is the only one that can handle Kyo. I don't know how exactly she's going to convince him to like not hate her. 
I don't know. I look at that relationship and I feel like it's a it's a better relationship than like assuming Toru and Kyo. And like, okay, so I don't know. They're they were talking about the true form. So I don't know if it's like the curse that's like specifically for Kyo since he's the outsider of the Zodiac animals. But I feel as though maybe it has something to do with the bracelet. Like the bracelet's kind of like um what do they call it where they wear something and it restricts their true powers or like keeps their true powers uh locked in i don't know I, I think something like that or maybe the bracelet is just a reminder for uh for kagura of of that day of whatever day she's talking about so i'm guessing um he looks at his the curse or whatever it is as as what it is a curse something bad uh of him that he doesn't want to get out or doesn't want to talk about but i feel like maybe kagura has the different side of where she maybe looks at it as a blessing or like maybe he did something to save her while in that true form but now we have this new guy um i don't know if he got his name all we know is he's the master of kyo i don't know whether or not he's a uh zodiac member he's a solo member obviously but he, i don't know if he as a power of the zodiac i keep on saying maybe it's the horse just because his hair kind of looks like like a mane per se but i could be totally wrong the last thing i will say is i found it adorable how how um so many of the soma members were very worried when toru got sick like like even hattori was like hey i'm gonna i'm gonna use my services to help you get better don't you don't need to pay me it's just uh, obviously he he blamed it on uh making sure the other somas find peace because they are going to be worried about toru i feel like he was included in that but even though he was brushing it off we saw like the other people's reactions like uh mimoji isa and kyo but anyways that was my reaction to fruits basket season one episode 23 if you like my reaction make sure to like subscribe if you guys want me to know anything more put in the comment section down below and i'll see you guys next time bye